Real estate agents tell you advertising is for your benefit. Find out what's really benefiting from their ad, who's really benefiting from their ads, and how to select the right real estate professional for your needs. Good morning. I'm Mark Renner from Berkshire Hathaway Ambassador Real Estate. I'm known as Mr. Omaha. That's my logo in the upper corner of your screen. And I've been voted the outstanding agent in Omaha twice. Today, I want to talk to you about the truth about real estate advertising. I want to tell you that, as you will see as we go through this, if real estate advertising doesn't really benefit you. In 20 years, I have not advertised a house in the newspaper or on one of those cute little magazines that you pick up at the grocery store. And in the last 20 years, 100% of my listings have sold. So let's talk today about the truth about real estate advertising. Number one, if you hire a realtor who will advertise your home, who will help sell your home. House advertising is designed to serve realtors, not maximize value for you. If you select your real estate representation by calling the, adver the agent who advertised the house, you're making a big mistake. You wouldn't choose any other professional by default, would you? Myth number two, open houses will sell your home. The MLS Multiple Listing Service is essentially a database of every home for sale through a realtor. Any licensed real estate professional can access it for information. And if you didn't know that any agent can access the information, then chances are you're going to call the agent who advertises the house. The better alternative is to call a realtor whom you have built a strong working relationship with. Myth number three, the best realtors will personally have a buyer for my house. When selling your home, You know, the best agents don't necessarily have, uh, when selling it, the, the, the buyer for your house, when selling your home, what you want to look for is a listing specialist, somebody like me. Our job as your listing agent is to get people to come to your front door. And we use our resources and our sphere of influence and the multiple listing and the internet to get people to come to your door. I most likely might not have a buyer for your house, but I will get other agents who do have buyers to come. So again, when selling your home, what you want to look for is a listing specialist. And myth number four, working with many, many realtors gives you more exposure to the marketplace. No, that's not true. Work with one agent and give them your loyalty, but expect them to work hard for you and to communicate with you on a regular basis. So don't choose your realtor by default. Don't choose your realtor based upon their name on the side. How to choose your realtor? Look for indicators of success. Make a personality ma match and make sure and certain they understand you. And you're gonna wanna go to my website and get my Special report, how to interview a real estate agent as you go to select an agent. Have a great day. You recently decided that the time has come to sell your home. Selling a home involves many critical and personal decisions. However, one of the most important decisions is the first decision you need to make a decision which impacts your entire home sale, which real estate agent should you work with? I want you to get my special report. Go get my special report, 29 critical questions to ask a realtor before you list, because finding the right real estate agent can make all the difference in the success or failure of your home. You can get that special report by going to my website, at markrenner.com and click on special reports. There you will find this report and many others. I can mail them or email them to you because I have them in a digital format or I can mail it to you. 
or just give me a phone call at 402-690-1687 and tell me which special report you would like. Thank you for watching today. Have a good day and be safe.